Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about Laplace transformation. So now I will show you how to answer. So we put the Laplace for the both sides. So, we apply the formula in here. That should be about H square, capital F of H minus S, F of number 0, and first derivative of the function at T equal to number 0. And the next one, we need to change into H, F, H, minus f of 0 and the next one now this one we change by this one this one we change by this one This one we change by this one, and this one we change by this one. Next, F of number 0, that is about this one. This one we have negative number one. So we have positive number one. This one, oh sorry, this one, that is about number one. So we need to expand. So f of h, f of h we can do about factorization one plus four we have number five so I will put this one go to the right Next, we divide both sides by this one. This one we can do factorization by H. Similar for this one. And this one. Now, you need to do about partial fraction. So, for this one, I just do one example. Next, we need to do common denominator. About this one, it is missing about h minus 3, h minus 4. 
So capital A multiplied by h minus 3 minus h minus 4. About this one, it is missing about h and h minus 4. And the last one. So this one we need to expand. And this one too. Next, we need to arrange based on the terms of H. About H square, we have A plus B plus C. About H, we have negative 7A, negative 4B negative 3c about the numbers we have 12 8 now we need to compare coefficients we just have only number 6 that means 12 a equals to number 6 we don't have h square and h so this one and this one equals to number 0 And now we need to find the solutions of ABC. Oh, this is negative number two. Now, after we got ABC, we put ABC going here. So A equals to one over two, B equals to negative number two, C equals to three over two, and now this one and this one the partial fractions that should be about like this now we compare this one and this one so number two plus one over two we have five over two over h The next one, negative number 2 with negative number 2 over 5 are how? Oh no, we don't have this one. This one and this one, we have 11 over 10. And the last one, that is about this one. Next, we do inverse Laplace transformation. So, we apply the formula in here. This one we have 5 over 2. This one we have number 3. So A equals to number 3. This one we have number 4. And the last one. Oh, sorry, this is negative because this is positive number 1. So that should be about negative number 1 for A. This is the end. Thank you for watching.